It's been almost 6 months since I have my AirPods Pro 2 and after using it for every single day, this will be the first time I'll be cleaning it. I know that I'm not the only one who doesn't clean their AirPods, but trust me, it is good to clean your AirPods every now and then because dirt can build up inside which will cause your AirPods not to produce the best sound quality to your ears. Also, if you don't clean your AirPods, it could lead to your AirPods not being able to be charged. To clean my AirPods Pro 2, I'm using this dedicated AirPods Pro 2 cleaning pen from a company called Hajibiz. A link will be in the description for you if you're interested in this cleaning pen. So go ahead and check it out. Before we start cleaning, let's take a closer look at this cleaning pen. Here it is in a nice little packaging. It is pretty straightforward. So as you can see on the front here, we have the multi-pen cleaning. That's what we have on the front. We have Hajibis on their logo. We have Hajibis um, printed on the side of the pen like that. And on the back, we have some barcode. We have the pen right here. And as you can see, it's like describing each part. So like right there, it's a flocking sponge, which I'll get more into later on in the video. We have Ajibiz and we have some different language that I don't speak and more barcode. And that's pretty much it for this packaging. Let's go ahead and unbox this real quick. Here we have the cleaning pen, which I got in black. They do have other color options, such as white and pink. If we open the pen like this, we can see that we have the pen holder, a flocking sponge, a high density brush, and a metal pen tip, and finally the pen cap. This delicate and soft flocking sponge can be used to clean the dust in the wireless charging case for the AirPods Pro 2. For the high density brush, you can use it to easily clean the dirt out of the sound outlet hole which is located right here on the AirPods Pro 2. Lastly, for the metal tip, you can use that to thoroughly clean the stubborn dust on your AirPods Pro 2. As you can see here, this is a two-sided cleaning pen. So if you want to use a sponge, you have to flip it like this and put this side in the pen holder. And if you want to use a brush side, you have to flip it like this and put the floppy sponge side in the pen holder. With all that out of the way, let's do a ASMR cleaning. I can't wait to see the result. Before we start cleaning, let's take my AirPods Pro 2 out of this case from Spigen. <sighs> By the way, this is how dirty my case is. Yes, I haven't done a deep cleaning since I got it when Apple releases it. Now for the ASMR cleaning. I'm starting off real soft with the sponge first. So see what kind of loose dirt we can get out before I start to use the harder brush and that metal tip. So as you can see, I got a bit of junk on this sponge already. So yeah, let's take these out. Wow, look what the sponge did. Wow, it's actually good. Wow, look at that. Maybe I should have did these hole first, just to make sure I'm cleaning inside out. But as you can see, I'm pushing it in there and like, just barely turning it. Not really turning it with a lot of pressure, just take your time and clean it. Let's start off gently first, and as you go, if a dirt is not moving, just try to apply some more pressure. Let's try to switch it up a bit and use the brush see what we can get done with the brush all right so here we have the brush let's brush that speaker hole right there let's brush the charging hole let's brush the speaker vent hole let's also brush this lanyard loop let's brush the back right there let's brush the button let's brush the led indicator also guys, I'm not scraping it, it's just a brush. All right, now over to the ear pods. So for the ear pods, I think I wanna take these off. 
so let's take it off like that easily and i think i want to start off with this right here just going to scrape the side let's put that right there for now move on to the next one let's pop this off also boom and here we have a big like airbox hope you guys are seeing that i'm gonna try to take that out now boom one scoop it is out this tool is really good guys all right let's switch up the tool a bit before we switch up the tool i want to give it the brush because why not i think this one right here is like the all purpose you can use this to clean almost anywhere on your ear parts right look at that it goes inside that hole nice and easy and it's just spinning spinning and cleaning wow look at that look at this guys like just look at that wow let's do the actual ear pods so for the actual ear pods i think i'm gonna try to use the brush and i might use a sponge let's try to use a sponge yeah so the sponge doesn't seem like it is working on this part so i'm gonna definitely use the brush on there but for the sides let's just use a sponge around because why not let's use a sponge in this crease boom all right i'm definitely gonna need that brush on these so yeah let's flip again boom and for the brush let's literally just brush this right here i'm not sure if you're seeing this on screen that little part in the middle i'm trying to brush that out wow oh, i think that's it guys i think we're all set here let's just put it back together so boom case is clean squeaky clean too brand new clean case right there and let's put this back all right this is before cleaning and this is after cleaning as you can see the difference is night and day especially on the airpods pro 2 itself by the way it not only looks cleaner but it also sounds cleaner so yeah if your airpods pro 2 is not sounding as good as when you just got them then maybe you just need to do a deep cleaning like what i just did in this video if you're interested in this cleaning pen a link will be in the description so go ahead and check it out if you're looking for the best case to protect your AirPods Pro 2, then check this video out. Thanks for watching. Peace.